I could sing the whole day long, it's not enough. Hey fam, what's up? This is Robert Anton here, robertanton.com. How you doing? How you doing? How you doing? <laughs> I'm here again with the So You Want to Be a Singer. Why you want to do that? <laughs> but I ain't laughing, okay? Not at the moment. <laughs> Somebody got me my eye up a little bit. And not really, not really, 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 but kind of. And I'll tell you why. What am I going to call this So You Want to Be a Singer? I'm going to call it Get Serious. Get Serious, people. Okay. Um, I'm going to relate the whole story. This person has not been watching YouTube for a while, so they probably won't see this. But if they do and they know who they are, they will see what they have to say about this because I just mailed them. Um, I was on Facebook yesterday or the day before. I think it was yesterday. And I was chatting with someone that I you know, talked to. I just said hello or whatever. And then we started talking back and forth. They said they didn't know I was in New York. And I wrote, uh, Robert Anton, NYC. And they're like, oh, you know, I, you know, that shows how much attention I pay, blah, blah, blah. So then they asked me for some recommendations for um, some producers, you know, and they wanted to get some music done and all that different stuff. So I said, send me an email to remind me um, that you want these recommendations so that I remember to send it out to you when I have time. So we chatted a little bit more or whatever, and then um, I think I went out or something. You know, I came home and I was... I was op uploading some new photos to my Facebook, so you can check those out when you get a chance. Facebook.com slash Robert Anton. Um, yeah, but I was uploading some new photos, and I came across one photo, and they had uh, said something to me, um, and I think I said something back, you know, and I said something about, uh, oh, I forget exactly what it was, but it was basically, I guess, to the gist of, you know, um, they said something like, I'm hard to get in contact with, blah, blah, that and the other and all that. You know, because they had mailed me before about uh, recommending some producers or something like that, that they wanted to get music done. Back in 2009, like September, October. But they, then they said, I was hard to get in contact with. And I wrote back, I said, well, I'm on, I check my YouTube, my Facebook, and my website every morning. You have all those addresses. So how am I hard to get in touch with? I'm not hard to get in touch with. The problem I see is that this person is not dedicated, not serious. And they said, oh yeah, I'm, I'm serious and I really, I just don't want to waste a lot of money and this, that, and the other because I've been through this and I've been through that and I've been through, okay. Then I just wrote back, I just wrote back, I said, and see, this, you guys get this right away, okay? It, it may be a few weeks before this is posted, but you get it while I'm in the moment of what I'm feeling. Um, I said back to them, I was like, I wrote to them just now, I mean, just like five, ten minutes ago, and I said, listen, if you are serious, get serious. You could have written me the simple thing that I asked for while we were chatting. You could have sent me an email saying, please remember to send me contacts to so-and-so and so. What this tells me is that you aren't serious, but you need to get serious if you're going to make it in this business. Because if they would have mailed me that thing while we were chatting, when I came back from my party and whatever and I checked the mail, whatever, you know, it was like four in the morning, and I was just like kind of surfing the net, I would have seen this message and I went and went ahead and sent them the information that they wanted. But I am waiting on this message because that is showing me how professional they are. You are not professional if I asked you for something, you say you really need it, but you can't give me the one thing, a simple email that I ask you to send. So what are you going to do when I give you these referrals and they ask you for whatever or they set up time with you to do whatever and you don't show up or you keep canceling, uh, that's not going to look well for me. It's not going to reflect well on me. And then I'm going to have a tendency to turn around and demand more out of people because you didn't follow through on this. This is why people who are A&R, people in record companies and stuff like that, they don't deal with people directly because people just are not serious. They act like they're serious. They think they're serious, but they're not serious because if you are asked for something specific, you should give that specific thing immediately if you can. And if not immediately or sooner, you should give it as soon as possible because that person is going to move on. They're going to see you as not being serious about your craft, serious about your work. So people get serious, okay? This is important. If it's important to you, then it'll be important to that person that you're asking about, that you're asking for a favor, that you're asking for a referral, that you're asking for a contact. 
But if it's not serious to you, if you have not shown that it's serious, then it's not going to be serious to them. And as they're going to start avoiding you. Because no one is going to put out for you and have it reflect badly back on them. Get serious, people. Get serious. This is your job. You know, I've heard a few times on YouTube from people, you know, some people say, oh, you're great. You know, and I love the adoration and all that good stuff. Of course, naturally, I'm an entertainer. You know, I've got a big ego. But there are people who say to me, oh, you're not that great. Or I know people who are better than you. Or, But I'm like, I know people who are better than me. The whole reason for my So You Want to Be the Singer, the whole premise behind it is that you do not have to be the best to make a living as a performer, to make a good living as a performer, to make a lifelong happy existence as a performer. You have to be trained well, you have to be dedicated, you have to be work your context, you have to be a hard worker. You do not have to be the best out there because the best out there are not doing the job a lot of times okay you have to be serious you have to be dedicated this is serious business okay it's serious business and I'm I'm not at a lack for work I am not I give out a lot of advice I've had several hour conversations with people I am not at a lack for work I could charge for that advice okay but I do not I could charge for this advice but I do not Get serious, people. This is Robert Anton, robertanton.com. I hope this has helped you, and I hope that it has put a fire under your behind. Because if this is what you really want to do, then you really need to get serious about it. Okay, peace. I'm out.